camera and today I'll be fixing my oldest slimes and we'll be seeing if I can actually bring them back to life. I am honestly scared because these slimes are like six years old. So make sure to smash the like button and subscribe. So now let's get started. Here's the first slime that I'll be fixing. And as you can kind of see by the packaging, yeah, it doesn't look very pleasant. So let's just open it. Uh, this just looks like a hot mess. I think these are pink jelly cubes and why is there this random liquid on top? I'm pretty sure it like separated and stuff. It looks like a monster just exploded in here. I can't believe I actually made this slime. I don't have any gloves at the moment, so I'll be using my bare hands. Three, two, one. It's cold and slimy. Ew. Oh, it's so wet. Let me just like dump this out. Um, It looks like moldy guts, but like the texture isn't actually that bad. It's just really, really slimy. Oh, oh no, no, it's getting on my lights. So for things first, I need to like wipe away all this disgusting liquid right there. <laughs> the texture is like pretty creamy as if there's like clay in it. Um, just splashed my freaking rug behind me. For starters, let's get this disgusting hair out. Oh! And now I'm going to split it in two. I'm going to dye this side red and this side like more yellow. Scratch that, you guys. There is another hair. Here's my red FC. Ew! Oh, okay, this is a pretty strong color. Oh my God, it looks like it's bleeding just in time for Halloween. It's not doing anything, so I need even more. <laughs> Okay, guys, this is the best I could do. I think it definitely has, like, more of a red. This side is a success, and now let's try to dye this side a yellow. Oh, my God, I almost forgot to take out these disgusting jelly cube chunks. Oh, my God, look at this giant bubble. Ooh. Okay, that's such a slight. I really hope this works because I hate this color so, so much. Okay, I'm going to use, like, a lot of droplets. This should be good. I added, like, half the bottle, and all it did was turn it even more brown. So I'm going to use this clay instead. And now let's mix it in. This should be, like, pretty satisfying. And the clay definitely reminds me of like cup, like pumpkin frosting or something. I definitely think this should work. It looks so satisfying already. Scratch that, you guys. These colors actually look extremely musty. Like this looks like a moldy pumpkin and this looks like an exploded cherry. So I'm just gonna add like the entire bottle to these. Much, much later. Okay, so after hours of using these entire bottles, it actually finally worked. These are all super buttery and creamy. So now let's finally add in the final toppings. Here's my container and now I'm gonna like roll these into little mini sausages or wieners like the tasty and long wieners the longer the better guys <laughs> now let's swirl it to make it extra pretty let's bring along this iridescent pumpkin orange glitter Ooh, this is really pretty and i'm definitely vibing with this super adorable strawberry charm i'm gonna add on this bloody red glitter to like match our theme oh that adds like a little bit of glamour so this is our final look i think it's actually gorgeous i'm actually super proud about how this turned out because i thought this was actually like not gonna work i didn't think we could actually fix that disgusting moldy old smile but anyways, let's get into the mixing. Oh my god, it feels so soft and fluffy. I think the colors really complement each other, and it's giving me, like, fall, Halloween-ish, like, apple-picking vibes. I just really wish I added, like, a fruity or apple scent to it. But other than that, I think this makeup was a big success. I definitely fixed the texture and the appearance. But sadly, the end result is kind of simple and has no scent, so I think I'm gonna have to give this slime makeover an 8.5 out of 10. Okay, so that last maker was definitely a big success, but right here is our next slime, which I have mixed feelings for. Clearly, it says purpley, but it has been sitting in the back of my closet for like five years i'm kind of scared to even feel the slime oh wait it actually feels not bad this is like clay i think oh no you guys oh my god yes it's completely melted it's literally just glue on the bottom it like separated because of all the years that has been sitting what in the world is this what is this honey it feels harder than the stale cookies i made yesterday the stiffest slime i own we do not need this i'm just gonna like take this out oh and just look at how awesome my hands look now Bruh. well as you can see it is completely melted like down to the core so i'll definitely be needing a lot of activator this literally looks like a grape guts Ew! anyways now i have to like keep mixing it until it turns into like a slime like consistency which might take a while so yo you want to see some real speed bitch okay guys here's the slime now it's definitely still stringy but if i just like need it some more it will definitely go away guys I'm not that boring and dull, so I will be using some instant snow to spice some things up. Here is my water, which I'll pour into, but I'll be adding purple food coloring to make it more satisfying. That is super satisfying. Three, two, one. Yo, that was so satisfying. It literally looks like purple clouds. It literally feels like a bunch of like kinetic sand mixed with clouds. And I'm just gonna keep adding water until it can't expand anymore. 
yes it feels so nice if this was like slime i would literally be playing it with it all day now i think it's time to add our slime this is gonna get so messy but let's go for it Ooh, i should have done this in a bigger bowl oh my god guys this is so freaking messy i'm gonna pour this into a bigger bowl I'm gonna pour in even more water because I can still see that like ugly white powder. Oh my god, it's like soggy. Good soup, guys. Good soup. Now let's drizzle it on and mix all that white powder into the slime. It'll become super duper drizzly and satisfying. Seriously, this feels like snow heaven. <laughs> Guys, so here is the final texture. It literally feels like grape fluff. It feels so soft and squishy. Okay, but how ultra satisfying is this? Like, I could be playing with this instant snow all day. Okay, but if this satisfying stuff was edible, I would be gulping it up every single day. I really want to eat this instant snow. Like, go, 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 go. did that taste good? Comment down below. Just listen to these sizzles. Okay, but there's like these tiny random little things in it. Like, I don't know what that is. I'm just gonna take a few minutes to take that all out real quick. Okay, so I put it into the container, and now let's add onto the toppings. To spice some things up, I actually want to add this, like, darker piece of purple to, like, make it, like, more spooky and stuff. And now for the super spooky glitter. And now I'm going to add this super stunning purple iridescent glitter. This glitter is one of my favorites. Yes, look how gorgeous. And to top it off, I'm going to add our final little pumpkin charm. I'm obsessed with, like, spooky witch night vibes. Oh my god, this, like, has to be my best slime makeover yet. Literally, look how freaking stunning this looks. I cannot believe my eyes right now that I actually upgraded that sticky mess to this masterpiece you guys have got to give this slime a name may the best name win in the comments the slime just feels so like airy creamy smooth and just so fluffy and added like no shaving cream in it but it just feels amazing like i'm stretching marshmallows definitely gonna give this makeover an 11 out of 10 also when you stretch it it looks like a purple spider web so bonus points for that but anyways y'all i really hope you guys enjoyed me fixing those nasty and old slimes that has been sitting in my closet for like forever to these gorgeous slimes and i think i definitely brought back all the slimes to life let me know in the comments which slime makeover you thought was better but my favorite was definitely this creamy cloud slime and i'm very pleased with the results because they all look so sexy put real pee into my slime why would i do that but let's do it anyway why am i even doing this here we are hey, at least it feels pretty nice and fresh let's fill our cup all the way it feels weird holding a cup of pee here goes nothing gloves first yes, here we go please like or subscribe it feels so warm help me oh my gosh this is disgusting it looks like the slime's peeing Ew. what is going on it looks like the slime's bladder just exploded let's pour the rest in now i have to use my bare hands i can't believe you guys made me do this on the screen are today's shout outs if you guys also like a shout out just subscribe turn your notifications on and be the first 20 people to comment hashtag notification squad on my video